Some people are really curious about joining the military. We all know that murdering is a sin, so some people are curious if they should join the military when they know they might potentially have to kill someone. So I have written this document addressing this issue. It is called Killing in the Military. It really depends. If your superior tells you to murder innocent people, you should not do it. If you are drafted to defend your country, I don't believe it is wrong for you to fight for your country. If you read in the Old Testament, the nation of Israel had to defend themselves against invaders. It wasn't a sin for them to defend themselves. I don't know about you. If I was drafted, I may refuse to fight. Many of these countries are corrupt, so evil. Many countries have little morals. It is not worth it. It is not worth it to waste your life for corruption, especially if you live in America. America is so corrupt. It is astounding. When people start to tell you to murder innocent people, that is completely wrong. Let me give you a great example. We all know about the Nazis. Hitler and other commanders told their military to kill the Jews. Innocent people. A lot of Jewish people were murdered in the Holocaust. There is a difference between defending your country and murdering a bunch of people. I hope you understand this whole thing. Okay. There may come a time when you are going to be forced to do something immoral. You must resist, even if you are threatened with death and other bad things. We have to understand that we can die at any time. It is better to be killed for disobeying orders than to be thrown in hell. Why do I say this? It may be a setup. What if you follow the immoral orders and someone kills you the next second? Where are you going to go? You won't be able to go to heaven. You didn't have time to repent. So, you would have to go to hell and burn for an eternity. It is not worth it. Some people may believe they have so much time to change or repent of their sins. We don't know what is going to happen in the next second, nothing is promised. Obey God at all times. It is better to disobey commanders than to disobey God by far. Really take heed to this. Believe me, I don't want to get shot or killed at all. Yet, God is watching everything we are doing and saying. If a person holds a gun to my head, asking me if I am a Christian, I would gladly say yes. I am not going to reject God. I may fear a bit about what those evil people may do to me. <laughs> After confessing that I am a Christian, other than that, I am not going to murder innocent people or reject Jesus Christ at gunpoint. 
What if I reject Jesus at gunpoint, then get shot in the head? <laughs> that is a straight trip to hell. Right there. It is not worth it. Just accept the consequences for disobeying direct orders. Eternity is a lot longer than our life on earth by far. Keep that in mind. So really take heed to really take heed to this. God bless.